Hey, come and sit down for, for a second and talk to me on this mic, right? You must... Are you, are you must be into a bit of dubstep. You know, we were talking about dubstep earlier. I bet no, you were into was a bit the, of that. There was a song playing before I came in, but it wasn't actually a song. It was One, just a noise. <laughs> well, oh, hey, who was that? Dubs. What? Was that Dubs? We, what, that we were playing before you came mm. in? What, this one? No, it was the Rihanna one. Well, the Rihanna one. Oh, don't diss that one. Okay. That's great. It, which bit of it was great? Apart I, from is the that the David Guetta one? Last note. Yeah. Oh, who's what that about this track? What about this track, Jeremy? Are you ready? Sounds like the runaways. Dan Al. Dan Al. All been done before. What, what? You've heard? You haven't heard that before? No, it, that's the exact song. It actually sounds very like the runaways. Okay. Uh, what about this? Oh, when we erupt into the room. That sounds like my daughter's iPod. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want another one? Uh... Oh, God. I got, well, that wasn't even a second's worth of it. was you... just listen, it was hey! And then there's that rather breathy thing that Simon Cow oh, likes to do with her. You can actually hear the voice. Leona thingy does yeah, it. Lewis. Uh, Leona Lewis. Yeah, Leona Lewis. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So stop breathing. <laughs> Actually, no, really, stop breathing. <laughs> you like Simon Cow, though, don't you? He's a nice, he is mm. a nice chap, mm. actually, Cow. I do like him, yeah. Do you watch X Factor on a Saturday? No. No, never. No, 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 I have seen X Factor. Yeah. I'm aware of it and what have you. And Yeah, no, I know exactly what it is. And it's a very clever show. Yeah. yeah. Have, you, have, you ever, have you ever spoken about music with Simon Cowell? Yeah. We, I mean, really properly argue about it. Now, I would imagine his... I'd be fascinated to, to hear what music he was into. It, he, he really does like those songs that those people sing. Yeah. Right. Those, a power ballad, and he's a happy man. Really? Yeah, he likes a power mm. ballad. And he likes, you know, he likes those rather dreary, breathy things that all these winners come out with. But I think he also, he understands what sells as well, doesn't he? And so, so I think even if it's not something that he's particularly passionate about, he knows that it will work commercially, doesn't it's it? It's a very, it, it is a very clever show. The idea that you can vote and you can choose who the next big star will mm. be is brilliant. I yeah. Really clever idea, but I'd love to do it. Where I mean, he's sort of trying to do it with Britain's Got Talent, but that just ends up with dogs and horses on it, yeah, <laughs> doing whatever horses do. And then, um, I'd love to do one where you've actually got to be able to play an instrument and you've got to have written your own material. Well, Sky did something, well, yeah, they, they did a show called Must Be the Music that Fern Cotton from here presented, yeah, yeah. and that was pretty much that whole thing. You know, it was proper bands playing proper instruments. But it was on Sky. I'd like to do it. I'd like to do it on the BBC where you win absolutely nothing. Right. <laughs> right. You can, you can chance, you can <laughs> compete for the chance to win literally zero, but you can, but you can win. So you win something and then you don't get a recording, well, you can go off and get your own recording contract mm. or you can go and put yourself on the internet. But there are so many good bands kicking around. I'm going in. And that isn't one of them. No, 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 proper bands. Oh. That's just someone with a laptop. That's the beginning of Hawaii Five O, isn't it? No, Wrong. it's not. Uh, it was very similar. It's not. I'll give you another one. That's Focus. Yeah, it is. I, I bet know. you love this, don't yeah, you? Of course. It's I brilliant. bet you love Focus. Uh, do you want to know which album it's from? Yeah. Well, I can't remember whether it's Three or Moving Waves. I think oh, it's Moving Waves. The guy is off. First time we played on the Fantastic radio. Fantastic stereo. If anybody's got that in stereo, it's very good. People thought you were having some kind of breakdown, didn't I they? Know. My family doctor, who's a little bit older mm. than me, texted me and went, oh, my God, I never thought I'd ever hear Focus on Radio 1 ever again. Well, there you go. Well, you just heard it again. But he loved it. He loves a bit of Focus. I love a bit I, of Focus. I saw them. Oh, brilliant. Sylvia. I saw them live. No, it's Hocus Pocus. No, it's Hocus Pocus. Yeah. Of course it is. It's the beginning. Go you got sent the whole uh, back catalogue upstairs. Oh, every CD. Desk. Everything they've I ever done. I saw them live. And, and I have Vish Van Leer's signed guitar in my office. Wow. I don't know who that is. This, I think he's in this focus. This and Jan Ackerman were both in focus. I knew that. Right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Where are they from again? The Dutch. Holland. Oh, right. Mm. Why didn't he say that then? Mm. Bam, bam, bam. Now, this is music, isn't it, Jeremy? This is very good. These yeah. are people who can play a guitar and write their own music. Yeah.
the yodeling stuff. Vocals are a bit ropey on this yeah, one, though. But... You ready? What's the snow? What was he doing? What's the snow? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to mix some stuff up. Well, let's play, let's play a new song and see if we can find something that you might like. I bet you'd like that. Is that possible? Yeah, watch this. You ready? Hmm. I'm going to find a track that I bet you'd like. Okay? Well, so far, he hasn't... He hasn't not said no, has he? Yeah. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? <laughs> What? This, what? what happened there? Do that? you ever... F this is as bad as I'm going to write a classic, I'm going to write it in the acid. Yeah, well, there. That was... What did she say? Do you ever feel like a plastic, plastic bag? bag? No. So it's no. Straight uh, away, sixty million people listening to your show have but, gone no. But you I don't. Mean, but you don't know what she's going to say next. It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's but she might go because neither do I. That would be mad. But she doesn't. It's well, a metaphor for life. She's carried in the breeze. Do you ever feel? Uh. Are you alright, Jeremy? Hey, there's a big chorus coming, big yeah. chorus. This is Katy Perry, by the way. Come on now, break it down. Look at his face, look at his face. That's not bad. Oh! Not bad, I mean, the lyrics are a bit Yeah, but it's a good chorus. No, you ready? Here we go. Come on, Jeremy. Come on now. Baby, you're a fan. He's very different when the internet's on, isn't yeah. he? Yeah. Future holds after a hurricane comes a rainbow. 